Storm's cleared up for now. We should be able to leave by morning. That's good. No. I don't have a good feeling about this place. Especially with me around. Are you... okay? <laughs> sure. Tell everyone to get some sleep. I'll wake you guys up just before sunrise. It's a diary. The head of this household, Bartleby. Apparently, he and several other families founded this little settlement to try and live on their own. It sounds like it worked. At least, for a spell. Grim? Just one of many hardships. Slowed down their farming, made everything harder. It's a shame, really. He seemed like quite the ambitious fellow. Always thinking of new schemes to overcome the odds. Hey guys, Crow said we should get some sleep. We're gonna head out early tomorrow. Thank goodness. <sighs> the last thing you'll catch me doing is letting some kid tell me what to do. Go to bed. window. Uncle Crow, come on, get up. <laughs> Leave me alone. Oh, we overslept. <laughs> Talk to me about stuff. Yang, too. Let's just get out of here. There. Can we just go back to bed? If we're all so tired, maybe we should make breakfast? You want to make it? Not really. You guys got the bike ready? Hmm. Well, it's done now. So let's hook this thing up and... <laughs> you people are just beacons for bad luck, aren't you? I'm starting to think the universe just doesn't want us getting to Atlas. It's just a flat tire. I'm sure there's a spare. It's not just that. It's everything. Storms, crashes, monsters. I'm so tired. Me too. It feels like we're always having to fight to get by. Yeah. But that's what we signed up for. We signed up to try and save the world. Not just delay the inevitable. Last night, I... I couldn't stop thinking. Why are we even going to Atlas? Weiss, we have to. Why? Osbin hid the relics behind giant doors under enormous schools. But 
How long would it take Salem to find a lamp in the middle of nowhere? But... The Grim might... They'd find it eventually, sure. But bury it or just throw it down the well? It would take years. It might not even happen in our lifetime. But we could be done with it now. It's okay. No! No! There's something down there! I saw it! It was looking at me! Hey, it's okay. You just said you're tired. It was probably nothing. Now let's go. What's wrong with you? We can't just leave! We have to go down there! We have to get the lamp back! Oh, what was I thinking? All we have to do is fix this trailer. Hey, farm boy, check the shed for a spare. I'm not leaving without I'll go down with you. We'll go down together. Fine. Get the stupid lamp. Oscar, fix a stupid tire. Where are you going? Where do you think? Stupid. Maybe the current carried it away. Is it? Turn off your lights and just look for the glow? Okay.
an exit! An exit! Are your eyes? They're silver. <gasps> you have a family? Friends? What? Don't think about them. Think about the people who love you. Focus on the thought of them. The way they make you feel. Focus. Life is beautiful. No. No. It is precious. And it must be protected. protected. Back in the house? Uncle Crow, get up! Hey, get off me. What are you doing here? We're leaving, you idiots. Come on! <sighs> Not yet. We can leave. Stop it! Stop! What's wrong with you? What's... Apathy. They're not strong or ferocious. They drain your will to go on. Bartleby's estate was hemorrhaging money towards the end. He wanted to cut costs on Huntsman protection. But in order to do that, he needed everyone calm. Always. Managed to get two away from their pack. Hike back was miserable, but got the bastards in the cellar. Wife thinks I was out sealing the waterway entrance. I'll do it tomorrow and tell her the truth once these things take the edge off of everyone. 
I'm tired. The next page proves that he did. But not before the rest of the pack followed their missing pair all the way home. My guess is they made their way beneath the estate through the water tunnels. That Bartleby sealed up the next morning. Bartleby's plan worked. No one was angry or sad or scared. No one was anything. And then no one was left. I'm sorry for what I said about giving up. Me too. We can't quit until the lamp is safe. It's not your fault. It was those things. I should have known. The signs were all there, but I'd never seen an entire settlement withered away like that. I... Suppose my mind just isn't what it used to be. Miss Calavera? How do you know so much about the Grim? And in the tunnels you knew exactly what to say to make me... To make my eyes do that. How? <laughs> well, isn't it obvious, girl? I had silver eyes. <laughs> 